Okay, so we look at Unreal Tournament 4, the alpha, at 21x9. So the game doesn't need a mod to run, and it supports 21x9 pretty minimally, but it is nonetheless fantastic. So it's a direct part of Unreal Engine, so its beauty is astonishing, and at 21x9 it only amplifies this. So, out of the box, the gameplay scales correctly to fill the size of the screen with extra view into the world without any nasty stretching or black bars. The HUD correctly shifts to the size of the screen, and the middle bottom section can be increased or decreased in size, and I made it smaller so as to intrude less. The issue this game has with 21 by 9 is the menus. The main menu, in-game menus, and loading screens are all exactly 16 by 9 They're the exact same display as they are on a 16 by 9 screen, except that they're displayed on the complete left-hand side of the screen. There's no black bar on the left-hand side of the screen. Instead, there's just a big black bar on the right-hand side. So, I suppose you can see this as a benefit. There's only one black bar to deal with, but it's a bit odd. It does mean that nothing is distorted, and there's no zooming or cropping, so that's great. But yeah, it's a little odd having it off-center, but I found it kind of funny. I don't know why, it made me laugh. Uh, but it's just one of those things that you hope they'll fix in the final version of the game. As to performance, I was able to run the game on ultra settings on a GTX 970, and I was able to maintain about 60 FPS. However, on the map Titan Pass, I did have some minor dips below 60 in some very intense scenes, and so you might want to drop one or two of your settings to ensure that you avoid any dips whatsoever. Now, returning to the visuals, this game is astoundingly gorgeous, seriously beautiful, and I switched to 16x9 briefly to see what it was like, and it is just so limiting. You can hardly appreciate the world that you're in when you're on 16x9 compared to when you're at 21x9. You feel so much more immersed in the sci-fi world. Now, an important point to note for those of you trying to get the game, the Epic Games launcher is completely messed up, and it requires a little hack to actually work. I know it's ridiculous, but it's a huge problem. Anyway, uh, I'll put some very easy step-by-step -step instructions in the description to explain how to get it to work, because it took me a little bit of research, and it's just it's complete BS how they have this issue on such a big company, but it is the case. So go to the description, and you should have no problems. So I hope this gives you some information on how the game runs at 21 by 9 Give this video a like if you found it helpful, and subscribe for future info. For any other games at 21 by 9 head over to my channel. Hopefully I've covered it. If I haven't, then leave a comment down below, and I'll try and cover it. Have a good day. Hold still!
Red flag taken. Red flag taken. Enemy flag carrier is hit. Red flag dropped. Red flag taken. Blue flag returned. Red flag returned. Blue flag returned. Enemy flag carried. Blue flag, blue flag taken. Blue flag returned. I'm on defense. New gear speed is a waste of good suffering. Red flag Blue flag taken. Red flag taken. Red flag returned. Enemy flag carrier is here! Under heavy attack! Enemy flag carrier is here! Red team increases their lead. Taken. In the face! Five minute warning. Two teams 
Tools. Assist. Now! You'll be dead. Blue flag taken. Red flag taken. You whore! Cover me! Returned. You whore! Red team increases their lead. Red flag taken. Blue flag taken. Red flag dropped. Red flag dropped. Blue flag returned. Red flag returned. Fresh meat!